Got 11 rebounds on the night to go along with nine points. The value of shooting. Johnson had the same exact shot as Niedermeyer and didn't draw iron. The block by Sampson the third. Joseph to the hoop. He'll go to the free throw line for two. Misses the first. It is closer than your right hand to the shooter. That looked a little bit like his dad, huh, from a long time ago. Rivio, great fake, too strong. Rodney Williams, number 33, the explosive freshman, is back in for Minnesota. He's been quiet today. His job is to go to the offensive glass. Westbrook, the corner three. Sampson the rebound. That's the best play of the game for Sampson. First time he has gotten something out of his own area. Campbell able to handle the press and settle things down again. Westbrook should not help at all and just stay with Campbell. Two point guards in the game right now, Ido and Campbell. Sigma on the block. Johnson playing with four fouls. Smelders, the kick out. Shot clock down the nine. And that's blocked. Stoll gets it back. Campbell loses it. Good defense by the Golden Gophers. Williams, beautiful touch pass. Two for four at the free throw line tonight. Now two for five. Six point game coming up on four minutes to go. The winner plays West Virginia in the championship on Sunday. Another steal by Nolan. And he gets fouled by Campbell. Taken out underneath. Good foul to foul before the, the layup happens, huh? Another no points, heads up just get possession, yeah, nice. Nolan gets bumped. Defensive effort at uh, for Minnesota. They're now wondering whether they have enough time to get to get take care of it. Well, it's now a four-point game after the two free throws by Nolan. Nolan's got nine in the game. When the ball goes inside, there's been no double teams. Everybody's staying at home on the perimeter. That's a wise thing to do. So it may rely on Smelders or S Sigma taking shots on the interior. Al Nolan should stay at home with T.J. Campbell. This is a great matchup of a good offense and a good defensive player. Into the corner, stole for three. And a rebound for Nolan. They survived a mistake. Somebody left stole unwise. Nolan to the hoop. Off the glass. Competitor! Competitor! <laughs> that guy wants to win. Holy mackerel. Two-point game. Let's watch Nolan and Campbell. See if Nolan stays at home with him and fights the instinct to help out. Skip pass into the corner. They switch nicely. If I was Campbell, I would go on DeVoe. Smelders. Pretty spin move using the glass. Like I said, it's going to be up to them inside because they're not going to get any double teams right now. So the interior guys, Smelders and Sigma, are going to have to make plays. 58-54. Johnson a deep two. Doesn't get the roll. Sigma with a rebound. Had a good open look too, didn't he? Now Minnesota really needs a stop. DeVoe staying on stole. Bad mismatch. Nolan inside on Sigma. And right here, Johnson on TJ Campbell. Stoll, pump fake. Shot clock down to 10. Good closeout. Shot clock at five. Campbell in trouble. Got to get it up. 
And that's going to be a shot clock violation. So the defensive pressure worked that time for Minnesota. Switching was what it worked. They switched every screen. They didn't care about mismatches, and they maintained pressure on shooters that way. Nolan's got to be feeling fatigue right now, the way he's played in the last six minutes. It's a guy who zone defense. Two points. DeVoe's got to get in a gap. They don't have good outside shooting in the game. Deep three for Rodney Williams. Are you kidding me, Rodney? Wow. That was an NBA range three for Williams, trailing by four with a minute and 20 to go. A timeout taken here for Portland. Do you think there's a chance maybe? Well, right now, Rodney Williams is out of the game. Westbrook is back in. Westbrook, better three-point shooter. And that's going to be a foul against Nolan, and that will be his fourth. To somebody who's open, and if he's not, get it up on the glass, and it's... Knocked out of bounds, it'll be Minnesota basketball. No one is quick enough, I'm sorry, Justin. No one is quick enough to get into the gaps of this zone. Too many passes takes too much time. That's what I'm talking about right there. The kick out for Joseph for three is short. Fight for the rebound, guess who has it? Nolan, toughest guy on the floor. Westbrook a deep three. Sampson with the offensive rebound. Get out, get out, get out. Nolan again. And that's going to be Portland basketball. So Minnesota had the opportunities to the game. They had very little legs in their shots. All of those shots were short. Turnover. Sampson puts up a three. Joseph. Nolan to the hoop, got the foul. He'll go to the free throw line. Situation. How you don't foul is Campbell. Well, you can't determine who you're going to foul because if they're good, they'll inbound the ball to a good free throw shooter. Nolan has four fouls. They get it to Stoll. Now they're trying to trap, and it's going to be a turnover. Minnesota, he is a three-point shooter. Maybe he's the decoy. Who knows? Man to man this time. Nolan to Hoff Harbor, a deep three, short. And the rebound by Campbell with 3.3. Makes the first. Season high, 23 points. Portland will knock off UCLA and now number 16, Minnesota.